Ciao, sono Anna e questo è My Italian Circle. Ruota, rumore, Ronaldo, orrore, rombo, amare, romantico, Verona, drago. What do all of these words have in common? But the rules are, of course. <laughs> How to roll your R The rolled R, R, or alveola trill, as it is called technically, is one of the most difficult sounds for some foreigners to produce, depending on their nationality. This special sound can be found not only in Italian, but also in other languages, for example in Arabic, Russian, Spanish or Scottish. But what is the sound R? R, R. Exactly. It's a vibration, a stream of airflow coming out of the tip of a tongue, that's it. The difficult part at the beginning is to train your tongue to a new position and a new sound, but with a bit of practice you can do it. Cabrera, non cabri. Carimbaldi è morto a Cabrera. Two easy steps. To roll your R like a native, you have to put the tip of your tongue against the ridge just behind your upper teeth. Let out some air, not too strong, not too soft, like this. Ruota, Verona, Amore. The position of the tongue is the same when you say the word du. D, D. The. So, again, put your tongue behind your upper teeth as if you were to say D, and then keep it there and let the air flow and the tongue vibrate. If it's easier for you, start pronouncing a D and then add the R. But, important, keep the sound D, don't change it into G like English speakers do, or you will modify the sound of the R as well. D, DR. Dr, drago, drago, not dragon. In the English word dragon, the tongue is actually moving backwards. Don't do that. You have to keep the tip behind your upper teeth and let it vibrate. Drago, dragon, drago, dragon, drago. And remember, this sound is produced in the front of your mouth, so don't move the tip of your tongue to the back and don't try to produce the sound from the bottom of your throat or you will get this rrr, rrr. The muscles of the tongue mustn't be too tense your tongue mustn't be too stiff or it won't vibrate and what you'll get is this <laughs> It's very important to relax your tongue just a flow of air coming out of your teeth you have to practice, and once you have found the right position against the palate behind your teeth, it's important to keep the tongue relaxed in order to make it vibrate. Try, try, try to say words with R anytime you can or anytime you're alone, and you'll find the right position. Important! The tongue itself doesn't move, it's not a real movement of the tongue, just a vibration. Another advice I can give you is to open your mouth as if you were smiling. R. R. English speakers, for example, tend to keep their mouth closer than we do, so sounds come out differently. Let's try together. R. 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 Rombo. Romantico. Ragno. Put the tip of your tongue against the ridge just behind your upper teeth. Let out some air, not too strong, not too soft. Keep your tongue relaxed. 33 Trentini venivano giù da Trento, tutti e 33 trotterellando.
to uncover more secrets of Rosan's system, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Arrivederci!